सो टूडे वी विल लर्न दैट हाउ टू राइट द बी सी डी कोड ए एस सी आई आई कोड एंड ई बी सी डी आई सी कोड फर्स्टली वी मस्ट हैव टू लर्न दिस बेसिक फोर रूल्स फर्स्ट इज द एडिशन दैट वी यूज इन दीज कोड्स आर कोल्ड बाइंड्री एडिशन विच स्टेट्स दैट जीरो प्लस जीरो इज इक्वल टू जीरो जीरो प्लस वन इज इक्वल टू वन वन प्लस जीरो इज इक्वल टू वन वन प्लस वन इज इक्वल टू जीरो एंड कैरी वन टू द नेक्स्ट कोड इट मीन्स दैट सपोज इफ वी हैव टू एड दीज टू टर्म्स देन वन प्लस वन इज जीरो बट वी हैव टू कैरी वन टू द नेक्स्ट कोड दैट इज अयर नाउ अगेन वन प्लस जीरो इज वन Again, one plus zero is one. That's why we write here one, and here is the zero. That is our answer is this. And the second rule is that is in the zone area, we will plus one after every each section, and in the digit area, we will plus one at each step. And we have to learn this. That is. in the digit area if our numbers are starting from 0 then at the front of 0 we will write 0000 but if our numbers are starting from 1 then we will write in front of 1 this term so these were some basic rules which we are using in these codes now the most important three basic tricks by using which we can write the bcd code asii code and ebcd ic code in very easy way are these first is that is in the bcd code we will write numbers before the alphabets and also in the asii code we will write numbers before the alphabets but in the ebcd ic code we will write alphabets firstly and then write the numbers now the second trick is that is to learn these codes in the easier way we will divide them in different sections that is the bcd code will be divided into three sections as like 998 since the number system will have their own different sections so we just have to divide these alphabets into different sections so firstly these alphabets are divided into 998 that is first section is this second section is this and the third section is this as like in the asii code these sections are 15 11 that is from here to here is 15 and then from here to here is 11 next in the ebcd ic code these sections are divided as 998 that is 998 8 that is the first second third section now in digits each section will be started from 0001 but the third section of the every code will not follow this rule so the third section of the bcd code will be started from 0010 in the digits area that is here we will write 0010 and in the asii code the third section will be starting from 0000 that is here we will write 0000 now in the third section of the ebcd ic code we will write 0010 that is here we will write 0010 now the third and the last trick is that is in the bcd code zone will be starting from 00 and in the asii code zone will be starting from 011 and in the ebcd ic code zone will be starting from 1100 so now we have completed our three basic tricks and yes one more thing that is in the bcd code first we have to learn is that is in the number system we will write zero in the last term and we will see the second point during the calculations so now we have learned all three basic tricks now we just have to use these basic rules to complete these codes so now let's start first is in digits in the front of 0 we will write 000 and in the front of 1 we will write 0001 so let's start since in bcd code numbers are starting from 1 that's why in the digit area we will write 0001 and in the asii code the numbers are starting from 0 so we will write here 0000 in the ebcd ic code the numbers are starting from 0 so we will write here 0000 so now to complete these three codes we will use the binary addition and these two basic rules so let's start in the zone area 
we will plus 1 after each section that means in the zone column we will write the same value during one section so that's why this is our first section so in this whole section we will write just only 0 0 as the same in the ASCII code that is u11 and same in the ABCDIC code so here we have completed our this section our this section and our this section now according to this rule that is we will plus one after each section so here we are left with these sections and here we are left with these two sections and here are the three sections now let's start that means we will have to add plus one in this so that we can write that value in the next section but according to this second rule that is we will plus one in zone in reverse order that means if we add in this zero zero one we will get zero one but we will not write this value in this section we will write in this value in the last section and then in this value we will again add one and then that value will be written down in this section and then again plus one we will write that value in the this section that is this was our second step so now let's start that is we have to write here zero one zero one zero one zero one now we have to add again 1 in this value that is the 0 1 plus 1 which will become 1 plus 1 is 0 but we have to carry 1 to the next column that is again 1 plus 0 is 1 that is the 1 0. Now during this whole section we will write 1 0. Now again we will add plus 1 to this value that is 1 0 plus 1 will become 1 1 and we will write this value during all this section that is a 1 1 now same in the ASCII code that is we will plus 1 to this value and write that value during all the next section so that is 0 1 1 plus 1 will become 1 plus 1 is 0 and here we will write 1 again 1 plus 1 is 0 but we will write here 1 and 1 plus 0 is 1 so that is the 100 now again we will plus 1 to this value and write that value during all the next section so that is 100 0, 0 plus 1 will become 0 plus 1 is 1 0 1 that is we will write 101 1 during all this section Now same in the ABCD IEC code that is we will plus 1 to this value and write the next value during all the next section. So that means 1100 1, 0, 0 plus 1 will become 1101. 1, 1. So we will write this value during all the next section. Next again we will add plus 1 to this value and write down the next value during all the next section. So that means 1101. 1, that is 1110 during all the next section so in this way we have completed zones of our three codes now we will complete the digit areas of our three codes now for digit area we have the rule of adding one at each step that is 0, 0, 0, 0001 plus 1 gives us 0, 0, 0010 0. similarly 0010 0, 0 plus 1 gives us 0, 0, 0011 1. So in this way we have completed our this section. Now we have to remember that at the starting of alphabets we always write 0001. Now again we will do plus 1 at each step that is 0001 plus 1 gives us 0010. That is simply we can repeat all these values in our next section.
so we have completed our this section also again our next section is of alphabets that is it will be starting from 0001 again doing plus 1 at each step we can complete our this section similarly by adding plus 1 we can complete our last section also So in this way we have completed our BCD code. Now we will complete digit area of our ASCII code that is simply adding plus 1 at each step. So in this way we have completed our this section. Now our next section is of alphabets that is it will be starting from 0001. Similarly adding plus 1 to each step we can complete our this section. So it is also completed. Again adding plus 1 to each step we can complete our whole ASCII code. So ASCII code is completed. Now we can complete our EBCDIC code. Now first section is of alphabets that is it will be starting from 0001. Now our second section is also of alphabets that is it will also start from 0001. Now simply adding plus 1 at each step we will complete our whole ABCDIC code. So just from these 3 tricks and these 4 basic rules we have completed our BCD code, ASCIA code and ABCDIC code. Now let's see an example that is we want to write BCD code of the word OK. That is we have to write the BCD code of O and BCD code of K. BCD code of O is this and BCD code of K is this. See in the code here in front of O we have 100, 110, 